Hello, Mimico, it's your favorite realtor, and today I'm coming back from Six Drummond here at Unit 310, and I got something sleek, modern, and might I say sexy for you here, just so close to that GO train and so close to that lake shopping stores, groceries, schools, you name it, it's all right here in Mimico's most exclusive townhouse complex. And I am thrilled to show you this two bedroom, two bath, one parking, two balconies, one massive rooftop terrace with the view of downtown. Let's get inside and take a look. Coming inside, we got a really sizable lower foyer here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six feet long, three and a half, four feet wide here. And you got lots of room to take that stuff off. We got an upper foyer here. Some of these units are actually limited in this space. So I show it off here because I think this is actually exceptional. You can get shoe racks, you can have tons of storage right here. And don't worry, when I take you up the stairs, you're gonna see there's all that front hall space you've been looking for. Let's head up. Immediately, you feel the space of these units, which is so rare, especially when you're condo shopping, guys. So we come upstairs. This is where that secondary foyer exists. Nice, clean, wide plank laminate here. Tons of room for built-ins. Look at this space. It's almost saying, put nice built-ins inside me. Have all the storage you want. But of course, the reason it's not here is you actually don't need it because you have behind the cameraman a very large closet that fills this whole space extra deep. That's all right here. So this space could be built-ins with the bench. It can come all the way around this corner. This is rare amount of space. Could be used as a den, could be a little bar area, but I'm thinking, wow, if you're family or you're thinking about family, stroller space, storage, it's all right here. And that's not something we see in regular stacked townhomes, but you're getting it here at Unit 310. Let's see more of what you're not gonna get elsewhere. Come on. Welcome home to this. This really starts to feel modern, sleek, downtown, right here in Mimico. I'm loving this vibe. And that's the crispiness between the lights and the darks of our main living space. It feels elevated, it is elevated. Check out this kitchen, for example. Really nice full-size island here, no condo size. Two stools, lots of storage below for our appliances. Look at this, tons of workspace coming across. We got the nice quartz countertops, the double undermount sinks, and we got a nice, lovely stainless steel French door fridge here with that freezer below and easy to clean cooktop. Love these pendants, love these ultra high ceilings, and I love that it flows here. So we have a formal yet eat in non-formal dining space here, which is so clutch with a space like this. You want it to be versatile, and of course, you're getting versatility here. Look at this spot here for your credenza, your side table, your bar cart, and that's all encompassed by these huge windows and a walk out to our terrace where you can, yes, barbecue here. We'll get shots of these terraces. Love these. There's one here, there's one upstairs, and those kind of tease you as you work your way up to the massive rooftop terrace, which really is one of the reasons to get down here immediately to have that outdoor living space in a condo town like this. Incredible. Check out this space now. Lots of flow here. This is an oversized couch. We're not pushed up against this wall. We got room for lamps. This is where you're gonna do your entertaining, you're watching the big games, the watching of the movies on the weekends, nighttime, you get it. It's all an absolute vibe in here, and this really shows it off with the space. Perfect amount of space for a full-sized, house-sized kitchen, full dining, and now we got this living room space that really does have room to grow. You could get another chair in here, another chair in here. We're showing off with our TV space. I love this color block wall. Our TV pops here. You could go bigger. This is a really nice size. No, this awesome TV is not included. You're gonna have to get your own, but check this out, guys. This is sexy. Let's talk a few more details here. Little upgrades. Herringbone backsplash. You've got built-in wainscoting floor to ceiling here. These are the details you're not gonna see elsewhere. And it goes so well with these white walls and these black accents, yet still warm. You really gotta come into the space at Unit 310 and check it out. Now, what would make this floor even better? How about a powder room so your guests don't have to go upstairs? Well, we have that for you. We got an exceptional one. Check this out. 
Love this bathroom, one by one kind of slate colored ceramic in here. And I love this detail on the wall. The owners did this. It's kind of the Ralph Lauren, the polo, the Hugo Boss vibe, whatever you want it to be. Really good vibe in here. It really feels upscale, feels downtown. And it's large. This isn't a tiny like, oh, wash your hands in this side thought sink. Full size floating vanity in here. Great spot for the throne. And I like that your guests are gonna come in here and go, hey, so-and-so's place is sweet. You gotta check it out. And they haven't even gone upstairs yet and seen that patio. Mind blown. Okay, let's go up and see these bedrooms. Coming up onto the carpet up here. It's warm, it's cozy, it's a sleek, gray Berber up here. I really do think it adds an element of warmth to a condo. It's up to you, easy to change out if you want it, but it's ready to go as it is. Goes really well with our banisters, painted out pickets, nice rail, dark to match our flooring downstairs. Now I'm showing off a bit. Look at the space up here on our second level. You get a full kind of second level foyer here. And I'll give you the lay of the land. Family bathroom to my right, two huge bedrooms here with oodles of sunshine and a full laundry closet slash linen closet right here to my left. Let's start with our principal bedroom with a walk-in closet. Coming in, OMG, you're getting the sunshine here. Of course, if you don't want the sunshine, you can pull those window coverings across. Full terrace out here, we'll get some shots of this. Ooh la la, lovely glass railing so the views are unobstructed. You're getting the views here, guys, from the courtyard. And that's lovely, we got Royal York on the other side. I love Royal York, but for me, being right on the courtyard's got something special to it, a little bit more peace and tranquility. Really good size in here. Like I said, you're gonna get the full king, double side tables. You got room for dressers here, but you don't need them because of course, you have a walk-in closet. And here's all that space, certainly enough for two people. There could be hanging room, do this up how you want, do built-ins in here, but it's all fully walk-in, closes behind a door. You know you don't see that elsewhere. Let's see another bedroom. Coming in, another really good sized bedroom here. Make this the guest room, use this for kids, make this your office. You're gonna love that sunshine. Even the eye lines that push through to our balcony make it feel so huge in here. You got a nice bed in here. You're gonna get a queen in here, no problem, with the side tables. And don't worry, there's a full double closet in here as well. Tons of room, side to side, high. Get all your storage in here. There's no lack of space in this unit. Certainly no lack of sunshine, which is key. Just look it up, sunshine and vitamin D adding quality to your life. Here is that laundry closet. Really good amount of space in here. We'll get an insert. Lots of room for your towels and sheets and all that stuff. And then a full stacker, washer, dryer in here. And there's more room. I really like that there's space for your hamper so you can take towels and stuff to your big family bathroom. Check this out. Nice generous size in here, soaker tub, that same one by one slate feeling tile. Nice big vanity in here, great spot for the throne. This is really just gonna serve your purposes. Neutral, gonna last the test of time, but also a blank slate, you could add a little bang, pop with some art in here, personalize it for yourself. It's ready to go. All right, let's go upstairs, take a look at the den, and then the rooftop terrace. This is our plus one up here, our den space. And it is a den space. Look at this full L-shaped desk, room for a shelf, room for a large chair. And this is that work from home space. So you don't have to compromise inside those bedrooms or take up space on that main level where we're gonna do our entertaining and the majority of our living. Gotta love that. Behind the cameraman, we got a big utility closet. It's almost utility slash locker. Gotta check that out when you come here. And then the money shot, my friends. Are you kidding me? I'm making eye contact here with the CN Tower. Oh my gosh, room for the grill, tons of room for more stuff out here. Dining table, umbrella, huge sectional already set up out here. Just imagine. Saturday, my friends, come over, we're having a barbecue. We're gonna be under the sunshine here. We got the city skyline views. I can see the water through the horizon. I mean, you're really getting it all from here. 
all the downtown vibes, but with that small town Mimico feel. And this is really that quintessential hangout spot that everyone's after. Go train just over there, lake just over there. It's all vibing for me. I'm feeling at home and I'm feeling excited about it. All right, let's go back inside, talk a little bit more about this unit, this complex, this location, and why you guys gotta get down here. So let's talk about this complex, these types of units. Ask any agent, ask anyone you know who really understands real estate, where do I get the best value for my money by the square foot? And the answer is simple, stack townhomes. What I really love about this particular complex is the location and the quality of these units. So I really like the layouts, they're modern, the three balconies or the two balconies plus that rooftop terrace, these courtyards. But what really makes it rare is it's a smaller complex. So if you look at different complexes throughout the city, there are a few. Uh, most of them are massive, huge complex where you can start to feel that the identity of your unit is lost and even the identity of the complex is a little bit diluted. Where here, you get this kind of exclusivity with the location right at the GO train, which is so rare and so important with the lake, with transit out front. I really think there's something special to these units on Royal York and Drummond inside of this particular complex. Now this one, it's got a little bit more of an urban vibe to it. It's a little bit younger and fresher. I like it a lot. Come and check this out. Get the vibe for yourself. I really do think you're going to be happy. Now as far as Mimico goes on the map, people, I don't know that there's anyone who loves it more than me, but I've been saying this and I'm going to keep saying it. Just do the math between a main transit hub like that Mimico Go and soon to be Park Lawn Go and how close it is to the lakefront. And then look across the city at all these different areas, most of which are way more expensive than right here and think long term or even medium to short term about what's going to happen in a community like this. We are set in one of the most important, exceptional locations going because of that transit, because of that lake, and because of all the attributes of this community, schools, community centers, libraries, shops, restaurants, you name it. Not to mention access to the main arteries of the GTA, the 427, the QE, the 407, and the 401, all just minutes drive from here. Don't take it for granted when I tell you you're a 20 minute Uber to Pearson International Airport. You can go in five minutes to Costco. You don't have to waste a Saturday anymore, but you also don't have to compromise and be inside big box land. This is a sleepy lakeside community that really truly is a connected up community, but we're close to the action of the big boxes and the drive and convenience. And that's what I love so much about it. You get the best of both worlds. And when you add a unit like this and the value of a unit like this, it's a win-win. All right, team, I'm not gonna go on about it anymore. It's a beautiful day. I might resume the rest of that small cat nap I was just having up on that rooftop terrace before I get on with it. You guys, you can do whatever you want today. You just can't do it here. So I'll have to invite you to, well, you know, get out of here.